Good day. In this video, I'll be discussing how to use your compass divider for rapid radar plotting without even solving for a problem. To start with, we have our given. You have your required items and your given items for your required you are to solve your distance e to r given your own speed and time interval for srm given your distance from r to m and also your time interval and your travel time from mx to ncpa given your distance from mx to ncpa and also your new srm here are the formulas if you'll be computing for the said required items for your distance so e to r is equals to own speed multiplied by the time interval divided by 60. for your srm it is equal to your distance from r to m divided by your time interval multiplied by 60. to solve for your travel time that is from mx to ncpa it is equal to your distance that is from mx to ncpa divided by the new srm multiplied by 60. we shall now proceed to the use of your compass divider So in this particular video, I'll demonstrate how to use your compass divider without even using your calculation. So first, we'll be getting our distance from E to R. All you have to displace one leg of the compass divider, the pointed one, here at 60. Since you have our own speed and our time interval, so place one leg at the 60 and place the other leg at 12 here. This is 12, 12 minutes for the time. And all you have to do is transfer, lift by lifting your compass divider, place it at well, to represent 12 knots. The other leg will now be your answer. That is 2.4 nautical miles. The answer is 2.4 miles. The so next would be to get your SRM. To do this, all you have to do is place one leg of your compass divider at 60. Get your time, it is 12 minutes. Place it here at 12, it is 10, 11, 12. To represent your time. Next, all you have to do is dip your compass divider and place the pointed end, the pointed leg here at four to represent your distance. And the one with your lead will be your speed. Your speed here is 20. So your answer and solve is 20 knots. For the last item, Getting your in getting your travel time. So you have your distance that is 4.5. You have your speed that is 17. So first would be to locate 17 knots. So this is 15. This is 16. So this is 17 in here. 17 to represent your speed in knots. Next. Locate your distance, that is 4.5. This is 4, so this is 5. So 4.5 will be here. 
that's 4.5, to represent your distance. The leg having the pointed end represents your speed. The leg with the lead represents your distance. And all you have to do is lift this and place it at 60. The one with the leg with the lead will represent your time. So the leg for the pointed leg is represent here at 60. And just look at the result of the one here with your lead. So that's 16. This is 15. This is 16. So 16 minutes. So that's how to use your compass divider for rapid radar plotting without even using your computation. So I do hope you learned something about this video. So thank you so much. Please click the subscribe and God bless everyone.